Abuja will soon become a smart city. The federal government and then the Federal Capital Territory Administration are launching roadmap to carry out these projects. Now, let's hear a few points from the people in charge of making this smart city possible. We're going to be talking a lot, a lot about smart city and smart data and how to make, uh, hopefully, make Nigeria grow and Abuja grow. I can help uh, Nigeria grow stronger. It goes beyond just infrastructure. You know, we also need to stick technology to drive the city so that they can support what the FCT minister uh, is currently doing. So that. They are turning Abuja into small London. They are turning it into a smart city that uses information and communication technology to improve operational efficiency. For those who may not know what a smart city entails, a smart city entails optimizing city functions and promote economic growth while also improving the quality of lives for citizens by using smart technologies. Just forget big grammars. What do they mean by this? I'm going to explain in details. Okay, what they mean by this is that they are going to prioritize the life and properties of the citizenry. They are going to take care of the citizens as it is happening in the Western world. Meaning that when you park your car, you will not be afraid if it is going to be stolen. When you are at shop, you will not be scared this and that, whether something bad is going to happen because there will be something monitoring everything going on in the place. It can tell many good things. It is a plan to make the city a better place for us all, making everyone to be more comfortable and then feel at home. You know, for a city, to get qualified to be referred to as a smart city, it must have an infrastructure base around technology. The environmental initiative is going to be more functional. It's supposed to have an effective and highly functional public transportation that will be confident and progressive city plans. The people who live there must be able to live and work within the city using its own resources. Again, let me make it clear here that a smart city relies on the relationship between the public and the private sectors. That is, the public sector and the private sector, they are going to be relating cordially. This is not when a private enterprise uh, approaches a public sector to do some certain things and they will be turning them down from here and there. Come today, come tomorrow, this and that. There have to be a healthy relationship existing between the two sectors in order to make the smart city possible, to make it functional, to perform all the things they are need to 
perform in order to make the place a conducive environment for everyone. Even though some people will definitely be affected in one way or the other, which is normal because whenever a development is taking place, there must be some, some kind of a negative effect. It is normal to say that whenever a development is happening within a city or a place, there must be some people that will be affected at the moment of developing the area. But later on, those people are still going to benefit from such developments that will still come to such area. Why I am saying this is that some people that may be affected, whether now or later, let them calm down because that is a normal thing. Whenever something better is coming, there must be somehow it will shake some people before the good thing will stand. Of course, the roadmap is going to be happening around the 2040. That should be 16 years in the future. We hope to see it come to pass because our life is going to be better and we will enjoy everything when it's finally done. My subscribers and viewers on YouTube that is my YouTube family. I pray for more blessings on your head. The Almighty Lord will shower you blessings and then all your heart desires is going to be granted. God will richly bless you all. Please, if you have not yet subscribed, don't forget to do it right now. Subscribe and click on the notification bell so that each time we upload new video, you will get notified. Thanks for watching and see you in other videos.